video we are going to see the recruitment from BEL that is Bharat Electronics Limited. So there is a freshers recruitment happening for graduate and technician or diploma apprentice. Okay. So this is a freshers recruitment and there is no examination. There is no interview direct selection is there. Okay. So if you are interested, please do watch this video till the end. We'll be seeing everything that is selection process. We'll be seeing the application procedure, the qualification, everything we'll be seeing. Okay. So this is a recruitment from BEL and the post is graduate and also diploma or technician apprentice. So this is an apprentice recruitment. It is for the duration of one year. Okay. The location of BEL which is recruiting is Machili Patanam which is in Andhra Pradesh. Okay. So if you have not heard of the specific place, you should know that it is in Andhra Pradesh. Okay. The branches they are calling is I'll be saying the branches and the respective vacancies for graduate and also for diploma apprentice. So for mechanical branch, for graduate apprentice, there is 15 vacancy. For diploma apprentice or technician apprentice, there is 12 vacancy. For computer science, three vacancies for graduate apprentice and two vacancies for diploma apprentice. For electronics, for graduate apprentice, there is 20 vacancies and five vacancy for diploma apprentice. For triple E, that is electrical branch, two vacancies for graduate apprentice and two vacancies for the diploma apprentice. Last one civil branch is having 10 vacancies for graduate apprentice and 5 vacancies for diploma apprentice. Totally there is 50 vacancies for graduate apprentice summing together all the branches and 26 vacancies for diploma apprentice altogether. Okay so that is the branch and the respective vacancy details and as I have told the duration of this apprenticeship is for one year and the stipend you will be getting is for graduate apprentice it is 11,110 rupees per month and for diploma apprentice it is 10,400 rupees per month. Okay, so that is the stipend details. Next one the qualification. Mostly all apprentice recruitments generally they will be asking 60 percent of the first class right. But here you only require a pass class. That is if you have passed the examination means you are eligible to apply. That is you require a pass class for B or B tech for the graduate apprentice and you require a pass class in diploma for the respective branches for the diploma or the te technician apprentice. Okay, so that's all about the qualification details and also you should be knowing that only the persons who have completed their B or B tech and diploma on or after 31st December 2017 are eligible to apply. Okay, so if you have passed before this uh, time period or before this year or this specific date you are not eligible to apply on or after 2017 December okay so that's all about the qualification details you only require a pass class so a lot of people will be eligible okay now selection process is as I've told in the beginning there is no examination there is no interview nothing like that you just have to apply and based on your mark for the respective qualifying examination you will be getting shortlisted okay so that is the selection process very simple and also there is no fees for apply okay so a lot of people do ask about the fee details everything on the comment that's why i'm saying it there is no fees for apply next is the application procedure so just like for all the uh, apprenticeship recruitment nowadays a lot of apprenticeship recruitments is hap happening from the government organizations so the basic thing you have to do is first you have to enroll yourself in www.mhrdnat.gov.in so that is the human resource development site of government of india in that there is a specific page for national apprenticeship training in that you have to enroll yourself okay so in all the apprenticeship recruitment videos i'm saying it but again i'm saying once again if you are not aware okay so you have to see that site if you are interested in doing apprenticeship uh, openings or recruitments or if you are interested in doing apprenticeship generally you should see this website www.mhrdnats.gov.in and you have to enroll yourself and you will get a specific enroll num enrollment number and then you have to go to the BEL site so for this case you have to then log into the BEL site you will have to download your application form you can see separate application forms for graduate apprentice training and also for diploma apprentice training. So if you are interested in doing whichever thing that is graduate or diploma, you have to download that form. You have to fill it up and then you have to uh, send it to the given address. There is a specific address given 
to that address you have to send the hard copy of this application form along with all the necessary certificates it's hard copies self attested okay that is you have to uh, send the hard copies of all your necessary certificates and this application form filled and you you have to also self attest all the certificates and the application form okay and then you have to send it to the given address okay the address also i'll be giving in the description box you can see it over there okay so that's all about the recruitment so for the selection pro sorry for the application procedure i'm telling it once again you have to apply online in the mhrd and then you have to take the print out of the application form you have to send the hard copy okay so don't forget to send it also so that's all about the application procedure the last date is 26th of november so the application should reach there on or before 26th of november okay so that's all about the application's last date so that's the last date which is the 26th of november okay so we have seen about the apprenticeship recruitment from bel so i'm really hoping that you found the video useful if yes please do give it a thumbs up and also share it with your friends and if you want more videos please do subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and keep on watching